Uh, Wait a minute! <laughs> Wait a minute! What is that? Did you see how the nigga walked up, though? <laughs> Just like Jerome. Oh. What's his name? Jamie. Jamie! Jelly 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 I look real desperate right now. <laughs> Fuck out of here, Joe. It's okay, bro. The roaches is the best part. I mean, can't nobody hit it but you. <laughs> Nigga, look at it, be like, go ahead. Yeah, I know, go ahead. <laughs> you ever seen, bro? Hey, bro, you ever had somebody still want to hit the road? Then let me get it. it, it, it. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you want what? Nothing! <laughs> Get alive! Shows more than both. It's about the tabs. Yeah. 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 They, they, they try to, they try to still, still contract, give them the in studio like feel as well. Oh, that's down, more like on edit it feels like. Yeah. Yeah. Do y'all bank those? Do you like a bunch of those at once? Yeah, we done, yeah. A lot, like me and Los and uh, go in and do four episodes in yeah. one sitting. I try to at least, because I know he be going a lot. Yeah. So we live in Atlanta, then he don't stay there. So I at least, try, if I know he ain't going to be there, I at least try to go and record okay. something at least once a week. And then how do y'all absorb it? I mean, we do, we do basically look like people that we fuck with so it can be an organic sit down conversation. You know what I mean? That can adapt to the element enough to make it not look like what is going on. And just sit there. You like, nigga, you know you you can talk, right? You know? <laughs> we really just bring people, we, like you said, with people we want to talk to. Right. People that we know. Where it don't even look like we at work. Uh, they just go and just smoke weed and pop that like, bitch out. Oh, okay. Like during the interview, but John got like, you want to text me? Or do you have like a bitch in 85 South? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, hey. yeah. So, like, the, the main studio, because I've seen a bunch of different, it seemed like it's like three different backgrounds. Yeah, yeah, but it's all in the same place. That's all the same place. Yeah, it's all in the same little spot. Trap house studio. Same little spizzard. Just try, like, moving around to keep for gifts. Can I just get you little spills hot? We just gonna check levels real quick and go run with like me. Alright. We so don't do we doing that in here, right? You got you rocking all this. Yes, sir. You listen to the smooth grooves of Nick Cannon Radio. We're gonna get into some of that Peebo Bryson at the top of the hour. Got some new Usher featuring Kirk Franklin. <laughs> Make sure you hit that phone line. We got those plaid tickets. Oh, she got a, a new record that we bought. Check, 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 check. Sorry, sorry, bro. Can I get a mic check real quick from you guys? Mic check, one, two, one. Yeah, yeah. 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 You. Yeah. 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 Yo, who is that? <laughs> I seen a uh, clip that he put up was supposed to be him and Jermaine Dupri in the studio right, working on the confessions too. That shit sounds hard. I bet it do. Oh my what God. the hell he got to tell again? Oh, oh listen. Yeah, that's yeah, hilarious. Yeah. Ah! Yeah. Ah! And let it burn. Time. Let me tell you why. Yeah, you burn it. Let <laughs> oh, you let it go. Gotta let it go. I'm firing too. Oh, man. They can mock that one. It'll be another class. That is hilarious. That's what it is. We already rocking Nick Cannon mornings, and that is the OGs themselves. 85 South in the yeah. building. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Nick got another job. I got another one, man. Another one. Bro, man, another one. Up. See, we, we were just in here. We cracked the mics open. Y'all already going in on Usher and his new music. And, part two? Oh, yeah. Confession? Yeah, Confession's part two. I'm looking I'm forward to that. Forward. What are you about to tell this time, though? I thought you told it all on the first time. I heard time. some of the new album. What'd he say? It's bumping. <laughs> 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 y'all stupid. So what brings y'all to Los Angeles other than to congratulate me on hey, uh, congratulations. Oh, yeah. man. Congratulations. Are we your first guest? Are we, are we your first, first, first guest? Uh, of course not. Sure. Hold up. Hold up. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. Hey, are, are we the first one? We the first ones that's like my friends. Or? Oh, yeah, but how long you done had the one. job? Because like, this new nigga. Yeah, it's Monday. Monday was the first then guest. Then what's the your first guest? Uh, I mean, it's it's weird because I've been talking to everybody. So like, uh, y'all probably are the first ones that have been in this studio. Oh, okay. come on and now! now we're <laughs> yeah. We kicked it off. Oh, there it is. Now, we ain't y'all, playing. Got, y'all got a show tonight at the Palladium, right? Oh, yeah, going yeah. crazy. Going down. So going so crazy. tell me about the eighty five South show because obviously I know everybody know y'all crazy, y'all hilarious. Oh gee, pop it out, man. Hey man, eighty five South show is the wave. It's this the one stop shop where you can get you a laugh, or a song. You can catch up with what's going on in mm-hmm. the comedy world. Keep up with us. Who y'all do y'all been individually do stand up or y'all all on stage at the same time the whole both, time? Or both, we we, we do it both. both. Oh, okay, you know what yeah. I'm saying. And it's hard like to to be on stage with 
with a lot of comedians at one time, as you can see, it's wilding out. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah, trying yeah. to get all of us to be coordinated. Everybody just be on stage just doing what they want to do. But it's like to be on stage and allowing your brothers to, to, to you know what I'm saying? You trusting your brother's comedy. Like we just have that feeling when somebody about to say something funny. Oh, yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So it looked like a, a, a audio storytelling. That's called chemistry. Yeah, yeah, yeah you yeah, feel yeah. what I'm saying? It's like an audio storytelling. Like, it, it's just beautiful. You we feel come what I'm saying? from the environment of Wild and Out, though. Yeah, so yeah. it's like you know firsthand how hard it is to be able to blend your comedy with somebody else's comedy. Right, right. Like, because everybody finds different things funny and everybody look at things from different perspectives. But with us, just from the way that we built from having to learn so many different styles of improv doing while and out, when we get on stage, we already kind of built a, a, a just a bank of skill. And when we can just go off each other without thinking about it because mm -hmm. we done been doing it for so long, yeah. but we really partners too. So it's like, it's just that element of like you and your little brothers in the basement with mom and them go to work. You know yeah. what I mean? It's, yeah. just, it's just like being on the block. It's like you listening to your, like even though we on stage, we still be listening to each other. Right, right. Like we be talking to it. We like, when he about to say something, you like, uh, oh, shit. You yeah. gotta say, okay, like. See, that's it all that to say it's just the coldest podcast. Right? Yeah, it is. Yeah. That's the best way to put it. And if I doubt y'all. Catch them tonight, cool Hollywood podcast. Palladium is going down. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Alright, now that we got all that shit out the way, let's talk some shit. Let's yeah. talk it! <laughs> Look, Nick, yeah. Nick, Nick, Nick is a, a unique dude, man. He didn't got the regular He's radio rich. that him curse on that. <laughs> <laughs> we, hold on, we, we can curse on him? You cussing now? You done cuss like... Fuck shit, damn! Oh, oh, nigga! Power 106, this dude is a genie, man. Man, he, he's rich, he, he on a radio on show, and he got on a bulletproof vest. This I mean, man, I don't, I don't understand. This, bro, you rich as hell. That's Why do you want another job? Because, I mean, I'm trying to... World domination, man. Ain't you about did. The money. I'm about to. That's about the power. No, what you mean? It's about the people you can touch. What are you gonna do with this little check? People you can touch. What are you gonna do with this little check? It ain't about the check. It's about connecting with the people. Man, fuck these people. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, Nick. We, go, we gotta do it. Nick that read that 48 laws of power. He practices them laws. Let me tell you something. Every last one. Bro, they need to come on with it. They need to come on in with another jug, boy. Put your hands on everything, John. That's what it's all about. I mean, y'all doing the same thing, like the and. It's innovative too. I love to see it. See, that's I'm why I was asking why you getting another job. Cause the more work you do, you putting more pressure on us. <laughs> Cause we can't be around you and then then just be slacking. Yeah, you know I'm saying. Like, Nick already, you got Nick, you just got to you just got to you just got to adapt. You got you got to soak the wind. Man, five in the morning. Listen, what he got like another radio job. That means I'm finna go call Comcast and ask them if they hiring. <laughs> <laughs> So, I mean, honestly, man, you all do have your individual careers, but coming together, like, is it, do y'all ever beat people? Always, you know, people thought me and Carlos was beefing. Like, do, do y'all ever not, like, get along? Nah. No. We ain't because never we, fell out about nothing, Because we, and, and the thing is, we ain't playing. Like, we really meant, <laughs> yeah. you know what I'm saying? It's not a game. Like, ain't nothing to hide or any conversation that need to be had. We gonna have it. We gonna say right. it. Immediately. And I and think the one thing that keep us from beefing is we all individually fans of each other. Yeah, yeah, you know right, what I'm saying? Right, so right. You, it was never no jealousy like, oh, why he get that? Man, he earned that. There ain't no T.O. Michael thing going on. Nah, 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 everybody Michael. Yeah. Hey, everybody Michael. It's Michael, Michael, Michael. Michael. Like, who's Michael? All of us. Right. And that's the part that makes it so unique is because you never seen three people that can hold their own on a stage and individually can do everything by themselves, get on stage together and do it the way right. that we do it. Right. Like you imagine if, you know, Bernie and Sid and DL and, and, and Steve would have just came out at the end of the show yeah. and just got on stage and just talked shit with each other. Yeah. That's a whole nother movie. Yeah. Whole and nother that's, a, movie. you know what I mean? That's the element that we brought to being comedians and saying, man, you can get it with your partners. Everybody ain't got to be the be the main the main, main yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. People but, don't know how to share the life. There's the, plenty of life. You know yeah. what I mean? To to pick up on that is also you got to understand your role and your position in whatever you in in, in, in whatever uh, uh circumstance that you in. Like for right. example, I of course I, I get the, the uh notoriety and, and people saying this and that and the, because of the Instagram followers, but yeah, I'm new to the comedy, but I'm on stage with my OG, my partner, who I was a fan of, he has way more wisdom in the comedy game than right, me. Right, so right. it's like, I don't even look at the Instagram and all what they saying. And I'm like, nigga, he got to go last because right. he the OG. <laughs> right. This nigga comedy is funny. Right. And if, damn what y'all saying. Man. I'm finna show y'all why he need to do what he need to do because right. this is what's say, going on. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm, I, so I pick up and learn game from them on stage with like, okay. I jot notes down, like, okay, I seen how he did that. Like, okay, let me try to do that you, in my set. I watch how you cultivate from when you first jumped on stage to where you are now. Your growth 
is amazing. But I agree with you based off of how I'm a fan of Carlos just based off. I feel like he's a jazz comedian. Right. And if people ever know what jazz is, jazz, people who are like jazz geniuses, mm -hmm. they play the music because they want to play the music. They ain't doing it for the people. Mm -hmm. They ain't doing They doing it really truly for the art. And he does comedy for the art. He speaks his mind. He don't never hold. No, uh, a nigga don't bite his tongue. He like, like, and he go, he ain't, go crazy. He ain't even like worried about the big finisher. Right. That, like the, oh, everybody got their joke that they end on. Yeah. Carlos is going to go until he find it and it's going to be hilarious, right. but it's like, that's where you can appreciate true genius. And there's right. only a few cats who can do that from the Chappelle's to the Bernie's to all that. And then Chico's mind works so fast. So you get something different from all y'all because mm -hmm. Chico going to give you, he going to tell you about his whole day that day. <laughs> yeah, like, and it's going to different punch lines. His, his set is different every time. And then you come with the energy. So. I truly, you know, from seeing all three of y'all from from in, its inception, really, I love what really y'all really from that. Appreciate, right. appreciate it. I appreciate it. Real. Appreciate it. Going down, Nick Cannon, yes, sir. right here on Power One Hundred Six with Eighty Five South. This is something different, man. This is this is truly different seeing y'all do y'all thing. Now we should, we give you a lot, of credit, a lot for, of credit. Like, a lot of credit. I'm on the outside, outside looking in, hey, why, boy, I'm niggas fly. be talking. We be like, hold up, shout it. You finna talk? You ain't finna say that. That's what you're not about to say. OG is an OG. Like, like to be honest, I say, man, you like the most richest regular person I've ever seen. <laughs> like real talk, like you, you try to act regular, but it's Talking like, to the but with a turban right, and, bulletproof and a bulletproof ass on. That's the good part. The regular, but it's like the, the motivation. You know what I'm saying? Like every time you in a room, I always try to pick up, you know what I'm saying, something that you doing or, yeah. you know what I mean, trying to figure out like, okay, he handling this and he handling that, okay, how is he doing it? So it's like, all the icons, I look at you, Kevin Hart, uh, uh, Mike Epps, T.I., like I look at all y'all as moguls, you know what I'm saying, that's putting on for the culture and I, to be honest, I appreciate that. Right. You feel what I'm saying? So, so we we looking, we watching, man. Yeah, we grown, we, we but definitely we definitely like, watching, we, man. We realize that, you know, the reality is, our lives changed after we met you. Right, right, right. right. And it, it'll ne it can never go back to being what it was because we came in contact with somebody who didn't care about being the man enough not to let young talent stand around him and not just stand around him but stand beside him while you putting them. That's one of the things that I give you credit for is when you put, a lot of people can put somebody on. Like, yeah, go ahead, go out there and figure it out. Yeah, yeah. But when you gave us a platform, it was a platform that you created and you stood there and let us create with you and talk shit and yeah. tell jokes and most people who in positions of power would Make never fun of me right <laughs> you know what I mean most people who are in positions of power would never allow that to happen you know what I mean yeah. it's kind of like what I was saying about the 48 laws never outshine the master yeah. but you don't have to apply it in that same regard because it's like you can put people on and have us sitting on your radio show all these years later with our own platform and say I saw it, you know yeah. what I mean? It's mm -hmm. a beautiful thing, man. And I think that's what just being solid and, and having the humility and like respecting talents, you know what I mean? Right. And, and that's how y'all operate with each other. That's how we've always operate, you know, on the show and everything that we've always done together. But I got to get in y'all business for a second. Talk, Something yeah. I really don't hear about y'all seeing the comments and everything. Y'all don't really talk about relationships that much. Y'all personal relationships. Yeah, we do. Yeah. We do. I mean, we do. But I talk about in that's general. That's but I mean, DC, we know a little bit about your, your craziness. <laughs> but I mean, like, are are y'all single? Or are y'all I'm in always gonna be single. But I talk your yeah, talk. I taught you well. Talk your time. I taught you well. Yeah, I can't. Ah, it doesn't lows? make any sense. I, to I don't know, bro. My, <laughs> my crush just started commenting on my pictures. And hey, things, so uh oh, it's, it's getting serious. You so uh oh, you know, I've been on a throat for about. A minute. Uh, Next thing it. I know, I'm seeing LOLs and all types uh, of little smiling uh, uh. faces. So, you know, I, I don't know. Now we got to go know. to the comments and see who I'm talking about. Yeah, I mean, but you'll never be able to figure it out. So many different ones. I got to figure it out. Uh, 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 Lows like of all different types. Come on, oh, man. Let me tell you something. He is a connoisseur of everything. All I'm saying is. Go to any any. Instagram where it's a chick that's bad and look at the likes. He didn't already say that. Already I'm, I'm not, not doing this for me. He I'm already. doing this for us. Just be, just be careful with the one that say go look at my story. You'll love it. No, don't make the one. Don't make the one. That's the new 2000 to 3000. Man, listen here, man. New, uh, do you want a cartoon? d right is crazy. Did yeah, you here. really be clicking on that? I be blocking these for every day. Like, it's a gazillion. As soon as I block them, it's another 20,000 Go look at my story, my titties 
her app. You like, oh, <laughs> yeah. oh, my God. Are you just going to ignore the fact that I have a fat ass? <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. my yeah. comment. Who's better than me? Everybody, bitch, stop. Like, <laughs> now, Nick, let me add. Now, you ain't even know. You ain't just about to skip past yeah, We just saw you in the vlog the other day with old chicks. What's up, Nick? Would you ever do it again? Get married? Hell no. Never get married. I'll never be in a relationship again. We talk about this. You want to get married again? Yeah. Hell no. What's the That's what That's the gun. It works my love life. It's pointless, oh, man. I agree with you. I would, you already know. I'm going to have a bunch of kids. I right, I'm with that. I, 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 I don't want to have kids. I don't want to be like, it's look, it's gonna, I don't want to have kids. Somebody like you, somebody with some integrity to, you know, to change the to, to, to People change don't understand that. Yeah. People yeah. don't understand that. You have to change the perception of what a baby daddy is. I yeah. feel like you could do that. I, I will be the, the campaign manager right. of right. baby daddies for America. Listen, and I will be your treasurer because I got to deal with the money and plus I got Right. And, and the, on which? The treasurer. The treasurer, the treasurer. For baby daddy. Listen, that's an organization right there. <laughs> baby Daddy's Incorporated. Listen. Oh my God. And, 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 and <laughs> every, and listen. Baby Daddy's, Daddy's Incorporated. incorporated. That's Nigga, that is it. BDI. 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 Baby BDI. Listen. You heard it here first. Listen, because you got to understand, in the African tribe, you can have as many wives as you, you can provide. Want. That, that is an African law. That is an African law. That's how we law. spread our culture. And, that, and the crazy thing is, relationships is the only thing people don't want to question. Like, they'll question everything else you're question religion you're question everything but when it comes to going together no it got to be this way bro what oh, it's be, not real what yeah, it that's so that, that's, gonna, that's how them folk do it they do the man uh, husband yeah, wife that's be like, European oh, 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 all that yeah, right? yeah. we white be people. fucking we <laughs> go get them and be like who this is like, this is my girl who that is nigga that's my girl <laughs> who that is nigga that's my girl See, white people wait till they get married to have kids <laughs> why black people we don't do that cause we want our kids to be in the wedding it's right <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we don't, we don't pay attention to the paperwork. Exactly. And that's why, you know what, I think the people get divorced so much. I think the reason people get divorced so much is because you don't have to get divorced the way you get married. There if you is. had to get divorced the way you get married, like everybody got an invitation. <laughs> everybody got an invitation to your wedding, get an invitation to you your divorce. divorce. Right. You got to tell them yeah. why you get one. Exactly. You got to read yeah. that position in front of the They got to back judge. out the room. In front of the judge. You got to read the deposition as the why you don't want to deal with the same way we got I to watch you. I can't this. This is the board of directors of the, the baby, baby daddy. BDI. We put it together. Damn it. 85 South, make sure you check them out tonight at the Hollywood Palladium, Power 106, Nick Cannon Morning. You dig. Perfect. That shit. <laughs> we should do that shit for real. Get certified. Like, we, like, like, we should do like fucking infomercials. I swear, I'm with Daddy, that. Daddy's incorporated. Listen, a bunch of how many of you want to fuck all the women? <laughs> how do you want to fuck? Like, it it's it's just that like rule. that. <laughs> it come on just like that. No, with, and with the shirts, the baby that's the baby. Who's going to uh, 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 walk around with it? Oh, we got to have the babies. <laughs> Look, we gotta have the babies and a whole bunch of women. We just walk around with the babies. Baby daddies, baby daddies. Have you been paying child support since 2003? Like, like, you may you be entitled dead, to compensation. Like, 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 yo, and you get a divorce, you got like, it's like, like that's <laughs> real shit. Yeah. And do infomercials and that shit. Yeah, exactly. You gotta go to the divorce. If your baby is crying, pick your baby up. <laughs> put the guns down and put the babies up. Yeah, baby daddies incorporated, and we changing the philosophy. Uh, what it means dead. to be a baby daddy. I feel like that. Anyway, if, if, if I'm like, an immaculate baby daddy, if you ask me, I'm all right. So when we go and like defend people who not like, like yeah, the, exactly. the bonds of the world. What? Great baby Have you been daddy. paying child support since 03? You may be entitled to compensation. <laughs> like, Reparation! You know, 5K races, we gotta do something for the baby daddies. We gotta, we gotta do something. Tournament. If you got something receipts, like if you got we receipts, get some legislation on bring them. I'm gonna be a lawyer. Bring all the receipts. So we all the receipts. Here, though, just do a couple little drops. Uh, Nick Cannon Mornings, 85 South, and then right. you good. Bring me the receipts. <laughs> Hey, you already know what it is, man. It's your man Chico Bean. Hey, what's up? It's Carlos Miller. And it's DC. Oh, my Fly. bad, my bad. Right, right. Yeah. Money get confused. How is that little doing that? Yeah. Take it from the top. All right. Hey, you already know what it is, man. It's your man Chico Bean. Hey, what's up? It's Carlos Miller. It's your boy DC Young Fly. How you doing? My name is Carlos Miller. And I just got a very important message. Celebrate the coolest in black culture live as Regina Hall hosts BET Awards 19. Undeniably the ultimate night in music, TV, film, sports, and giving back. Find out who among top nominees like Beyonce, Drake, 
and J. Cole will take home BT Award Trophy presented by Yara Shahidi, Marseille Martin, Morris Chestnut, and more. Watch DJ, watch DJ Khaled and friends smash the stage. Tune in to see the Lifetime Achievement Award, Humanitarian Award, and Icon Award recipients. Those tributes will break the internet this year. <laughs> And you gotta see the timeline crushing performances by Cardi B, Her, Lizzo, Lil Nas X, Billy Ray Cyrus, Lil Baby, Young Miami, Migos, and more. BET Awards 19 celebrate our cool lives Sunday, June 23rd at 8, 7 central on BET. To get the latest and to get ready for the BET Awards big night, search hashtag BET Awards and visit BET.com. Oh, you ain't holding that. Did you get my hat checked? Yes. Come on, this fly. No, you left my junk, bro. You irresponsible. Where you at, Lowe's? Where you grabbed it? No, I remember I handed it to you. I, and I you... take it. How did I leave it if I don't know where the fuck you put it? Hey. <laughs> You remember when you called him a lesbian? I did. Okay. I didn't bring it up for a reason, Jeff. I didn't bring it up for a reason. We still okay. talking about that shit. Jeff, drop it, bro. It's not funny. Drop it, bro. It's not funny. It's not funny no more, Jeff. Jeff, it's not funny, dog. My, hurting my feelings is not funny. You hurt. You don't even have fun. And we will be lying. So, no curse. No curse. Yeah, hey, listen, man. Free Real Street Fest tickets are yours right now. 866-246-8923. Let's go. Real 923 LA's new home for hip-hop and tickets to Real Street Fest. Starring me, those Cardi B, Future, Big Sean, Meek Mill, 2 Chains, Blueface, ASAP, Rocky, Lil Baby. We could keep going over 30 acts. Special surprise guests. We talking two days, three stages, and so much more. You can get the complete lineup. Buy tickets right now at realstreetfest.com. And don't forget, I'll keep everybody at AT&T. More for your thing. Okay, here they go. Carlos Miller is yes, here. Chico Bean. Yeah, man. Gentlemen, everything yes, good? I'm feeling amazing. good, man. Feeling good. California sunshine. Yeah, loving the weather out here. That's right. That's right. We smoking heavy out here while we out here. Heavy, what we doing? heavy, you good. Heavy. Heavy. God dang, gonna heavy. know it. Look, I almost I caught myself. No cursing. We live. Easy now, easy now, right? I know, man. Did y'all bring some for the rest of us? Or? Uh, nope. I mean, I'm here. <laughs> nope. Nope. Yeah, yeah, nope. Y'all should have yeah, bought some for us. Yeah, right. We got it. You know, no problem, man. They sell it downstairs. Come on now. Word. Ain't God good? Oh, I'm about to say, well, I'm about to go. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for the opportunity. We out. I see y'all. Thank you. Thank so you. So listen, man, we're going on tour, right? Yes, yes sir. The South uh, show. Now, you guys, this started as a conversation or conversations that you guys were having in private. And it exactly. just went, it, you know, it turned into a show. And you guys said, uh, yo, let's take this on the road. And boom, we're here now. Man, right. you just put it, you summed it up. Right, yeah, man. I, I can't even add nothing to it. I'm right. like, yeah. that's, that's, some, that's what my, he studied last right. night. Right. He had his laptop on his lap last night, Googling facts. That's what he did. You know everything. Yeah. No, no, that's, so, basically, that's basically how it started. Sure. You know what I'm saying? We just started, you know what I mean? Just went from a combo and then, mm -hmm. you know, went from combo to start doing them live. And before you, you remember when people weren't even coming to our show? Oh, yeah. oh is that right? Man, yeah. Was, man, people weren't even bringing the money. They were talking about, we know these folks, they come in. <laughs> so it's like, now to just see us elevate from the game, man, and just see where we at now, man. Just, it's just is that a bruise of the ego, though? Or nah, nah. It's a part of the process. We got work to do and it's a process. It's a part it's of the process. process. Yeah, it don't matter who you is. We was on TV then. Right, it don't matter. Yeah, yeah. and this Sunday we starting from the from the ground up. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, hey, and, and fellas, correct me if I'm wrong, but there's no script. We going off the top. Off yeah. the tizzle. Yeah. That's what makes it so unique is exactly, the fact that we, bro. you know, mesh with each other so well that we can get on stage. No and just create, script. You know what I mean? And just does be that able take to... the, the the pressure off as well? Or does that add pressure? Because we, you know, we no, gotta come nothing. up with Nah, it, I don't even think we think about the pressure because it's we excited about being able to be on stage with one another. No. 
See? You know what I'm saying? Like just that just just what it is. It's always an event. Like this is how we interact. So no matter where we're doing it, it's gonna so, go down so like what that. has been said, and please keep it clean if you can, fellas. But uh what has been said at the show, just off top, you guys are just riffing, you guys doing your thing. Say you say, uh, keep it clean. Please. I don't think that clean happened. Yeah, yeah, so. no, we don't have no clean. Oh, we got some clean. But we have some of the rawest laughs. The venues have it's got clean. It's the fans. You know I, mean? I, 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 I I can't know. say one, but I ain't gonna curse. Go ahead. We Go. had an auntie to show us some saggy titties. No. <laughs> yeah. Can you say Repeatedly. Can y'all say that? Repeatedly. Can y'all say that? Oh, no, scream. <laughs> Listen. Hey, fly, blow. I don't like the way Drake looking at me, man. Y'all could have got another picture. Like, this dude been staring at me since I walked in the studio. Like, what y'all got going on there? During the finals, Drake was having a good time, but was that annoying? Like, if you're on the court no. playing, are you choking Drake out? Man, no. I ain't going to lie, man. It don't matter if you playing tonight. Once you once you get in, you emotional. Come on, man. And you Thank sitting you. that close. To what's really going on? Yes. Well, it's gonna be hard for me to not get on the coach, but <laughs> <laughs> and for what I've had to pay for the ticket to sit right there, you damn right I'm involved in the game. I am the coach. Yes, I'm on it. Now let Drake make it, man. He been a super fan. He would have did that if it was NCAA or soccer yeah. or volleyball. Right. He's right. just a fan right. like that. You right. can't get mad at Drake. That's right. The show's tomorrow. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yep. Palladium. Uh oh. Yep. Pal I swear. I, I, uh oh. I got an announcement. I got an announcement. I got an announcement. We had such a high demand. We just opened up a hundred more uh, VIP. Let's go. Yeah. Come on. Come on. That's no, Go to 85southshow.com. No you can hit our website. <laughs> Get them off our website. <laughs> Listen, more with DC Young Fly, Carlos Miller, Chico B. Chico B. Hey, why you say my name like that standing behind me, man? Hey, man. hey DC, who is my man? You know him? Oh, okay. Hey, right. hey, right. well, hey, man, chill. Lisa asked my name first as a handshake, don't What did you say? What happened? He just went, she ain't gonna be in here. I'm like, what's going on? Why you just moan my name like that? Yo, you gotta chill, bro. We Mexicans, we hear beam, we get excited, bro. Yo, hey, I don't know if he got that excited. Why is he dressed like the, why is he dressed like the finish line? Yeah, <laughs> All right, what's up with you already know what it is, man? It's your man Chico Bean. It's your man Carlos Miller. It's your boy DC Young Flizzle. And we on the cruise show with Real 92.3, LA's new home for hip hop. What was the old home? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what's up? This is Carlos Miller and congrats to Jay Cruz on the move to real 92.3. Did you get a moving company to move with? I don't know. <laughs> yes, yes, nah, we we moved Mexican, though. We moved it up. <laughs> he said they were Mexican. They did it themselves. Like, Cruise show. Uh oh, you already know what time it is. Your boy DC on fly, and you're checking out the Fuego Five at five on the Cruise Show on the Real 92.3. Uh -huh. Hey, you already know what it is, man. It's Chico Bean and D DJ Leslie. You got a lot of ease in that. In the mix on the cruise show on Real 92.3. Hey, what's up? It's your man Carlos Miller and DJ Leslie is in the mix on the cruise show. Real 92.3. Uh-oh, you already know what time it is. Your boy DC Young Flizzle. DJ Leslie is in the mix on the cruise show on Real 92.3. Oh, and she the real lesbian. Uh, she a real lesbian. Oh, for real? Oh, yeah. Leslie, she on the screen. Not, not, not that's what they all say. <laughs> that's what they all say. <laughs> <laughs> After a couple of years. I thought I saw some sussy talking about lesbian. You know what I'm saying? You are listening to the real 92.3 with Chico Bean and me in DC. In place by me. I don't want to fuck you, bro. What's up, big boy? Oh, you good? home for hip hop and tickets to Real Street Fest. Migos, uh, Cardi B, Future, ASAP Rocky, Blueface, Two Chains, over thirty acts. We talking three stages, two days. Let's go, RealStreetFest.com to buy tickets. Don't care about eighteen T more for anything. Where Lydia at, man? Lydia from NoHo, North Hollywood. She's on the phone line one. Hey, Lydia. Hey, Lydia. There she hey. is. Hey. Yo, you're hey, pulling ten. You're going to Real Street Lydia. Fest. Lydia. Congratulations, okay? Yeah, Lydia. Yo, tell them. Tell her who's gonna be there. Well, now. first of all, you gotta mention Meg the Stallion, cause That's the Stallion right. is in the building. Let's go, let's go. Two chains gonna be there. Meek Mill, oh, Big oh, Sean, Meek Roddy Meek Rich, and then by the end season, then 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 come in the beat. Uh oh, look at I like Roddy Rich. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Boogie with the hoodie, Trippy Red, Rich the Kid, Migo, Kid Boo, Got my J Rock. 
YBN, Corday, Zoe Uh-oh. Dallas, Salt Weedy, everybody going to be there. Super <laughs> duper Kyle. The guys have to right thank there. all 30 acts, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Super yeah. duper Kyle. Future Migos. Me? When they put me on the list, Cardi me. B. Yeah. DJ Leslie going to be there. Man, super Bro- duper Bro- Gonna be there. Me, the on the list. DC <laughs> gonna stop through. Mm-hmm. Man, Wendy Williams gonna be there. Morgan Freeman's right, nephew everybody is we gonna said, be there. Said, Wendy Am Wendy. I the only one that's excited about Super Duper Kyle? <laughs> that's your name, right there. Young Sheck West is in the building. That's right. That's right. Uh oh, we forgot one, y'all. Who? Okay. We can't do it. Close your eye, Young Pinch. Hey, hey, flip the Nero. Come here, let me paint you. Guess who else going to be there? Lydia. Ow! Lydia. Super Duper Cow. We're just not going to keep skipping over Super Duper Cow. I spy with my little eye. The show is tomorrow, Hollywood Palladium. We just released some more tickets, fellas. Uh-oh. We did. Uh-oh. Yeah, we did. Y'all. Uh-oh. 100 more. We done released 100 more. 100 more. 100. How many sold? Hey, uh, I don't None. know yet. Okay, hey, come on. 100 more. Cruz, real quick hey. question. Who picked the pictures in here? Why y'all got Cube looking all aggressive? Who y'all got <laughs> scared, man? Y'all, it's, these dudes are superstars. They took these a lot of pictures. Real. You didn't pick the meanest pictures to put in your studio. Let me tell you something, though. These we can't have a real. smiling ice cube on the wall. Man. Yeah. I mean, yeah, but the show the hat or something. He ain't got Gotta be looking like Debo. That's crazy. <laughs> Look at Rihanna. She looked like some dude spoke to her and she didn't want to speak back. She ready to take her earring off for the fight. Look, it's crazy. The young Rihanna. Really. Right 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 That's when he was beefing with Machine Gun Killer. <laughs> That's right after. He said, I know this nigga. He talking about me. <laughs> take it easy. Take it easy. Oh, man. Listen, you guys got to see these guys. Uh oh. Do we have like special surprise guests coming through as I well? Mean, I ain't, boy, I ain't no I don't know. Like, you never know who well, my You got know a lot everybody. Of, got Look, a lot of cousins there. I heard that. I ain't know who yeah, <laughs> say that. Don't tell him. Yeah. Bro, the dude who used to hoop with Kobe at the uh, at LA Fitness, he coming. <laughs> yeah, that's right, that's right. He trying for two years. That boy cold. He almost won one game. That boy is cold. Mel Gibson. Mel Gibson's limo driver. He will be in the building. Oh! That's right. That's yeah. right. That's right. Do we meet fans after the show? Of course. Yeah. We have a live meet and greet where we take show pictures, will. turn up, chill. When I wave and walk off. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we just opened up a hundred more tickets for you to see DC wave and walk off. A hundred times right in a row. Y'all to get y'all a hundred times. I'm real. Hey, and y'all record the show right and throw it up on YouTube on yeah. Friday. Show how LA is right. Exactly. You know amazing, what I'm saying? Amazing. Yeah. Uh, DC amazing. Young Fly, congratulations to you. Variety has been one of the kind of things. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So good, man. I appreciate it, man. They're trying to stay working, man. God is real, man. So, you know, I'm, I'm just walking in my purpose right now. So, we, we here. I'm here with the gang. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? I remember when we started from the ground up. We here. Yeah. And 923 going crazy with the gang. Because y'all Where real. Hey, calm down the Ice Cube studio, man. You see how he looks. Don't be too aggressive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> man, dog, you guys are welcome here anytime, man. Straight up. Sure. Now that we know that, we're going to definitely take advantage of it. <laughs> right. We're not and don't like, just leave it. Exactly. right back. Yeah. Like, no. <laughs> Today. Three, People, this at now nah, this LA too. You know how to sell a dream. Come up here whenever. Now I'm Von L Hill show when Martin was on there. I can't even get upstairs. You're who? Chico B. Yeah, I know man the studio. We got the oh, ice yeah. cube in I'm the pit. Coming back no, back. We got another interview. So if you heard us right now, you gonna hear again later on tonight. <laughs> 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 right the only hip hop radio station that matters in Los Angeles. Come on, now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. One of us on the beach. Real 92. <laughs> 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 Did you just call him Leche? Go way back. No way back. No way back. We cool. I just want to congratulate him on his success. He told me he hasn't slept in three days though. Oh, DC hasn't slept in three days. Yeah, I ain't slept in three days, man. Hold on, bro. Did you call him Leche? Leche. Ain't that milk? Don't get me. Bro, I know my Spanish. Lechero. Milk man, because I was delivered. Okay. Oh, I thought it was because you had. Never mind. No. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I respect milk. milk. Why you saying it? Why you saying it? Carlos, milk got the Janet Jackson Rhythm Nation earring in his ear. Right here. I'm telling you, he's I a can't legend. trust him because he's a big dude, but he's athletic and he flexible. He's going crazy. Shout out to Leche. I said 92.3 in Spanish. New Era on the 2.3. Long that ain't what that ain't how you say it. Hey, DC, he just called you a name. He called me puto. Punto. Yeah. He called me, that what he said? That's what he said. Oh. What he said? Uh, that, punto, man. Hey, that's oh. great. Hey, you got to bleep out Spanish curse words out here, too. But that's my man, right? DC, you don't like Carlos Miller. Chico Bean. Hey, man, y'all stop saying my name like that, man. Hey, yo, Chico Bean. 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 Ch
got a Carlos and a Bean, and not one of them are Mexican. Come on, man. Oh, oh, hey, man, you know don't, judge, don't judge me. Don't judge me. Don't judge me. Don't judge me. I support my, <laughs> support my Mexican family. Yeah, salute to all y'all. Salute to them. God salute, man. Let's El Negro de Carlos. Appreciate that. What'd you say, Carlos? El Negro de Carlos. Very black guy. Go loco. The Hollywood Palladium, man. Appreciate y'all. You know you ain't coming, Cruz. Stop it. Cruz, stop flexing. You better come. I'm coming through. No, you're not. Yeah, man. All right, come on through. Can I bring y'all on stage or no? That's a no. Okay. Uh -huh. Let's we'll see you at the show. We're going to have two, three, 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 Leslie. Let's go. All right. Quiet. You're six. You know you're welcome. We're going to do a podcast, right? We're having a podcast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. Yeah. Come on. Yo. I'm trying to draw. Who's that, yo? He was. <laughs> I'm gonna tell that it there, you guys was good. Good morning, sir. Thought you were gonna go down and in. Good morning, this is Carlos Miller, and you are listening to the goodest radio station in the world, <laughs> the Steve Harvey Morning Show. <laughs> hey, it's Carlos Miller. Make sure you check out SteveHarveyFM.com on the Steve Harvey. Morning show. <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. Hey, this is Carlos Miller, and coming up next, nephew Tommy is going to run that prank back. Yes, he will. That boy can read. That boy can read. Knock it out, homie. Uh -oh. <laughs> that boy, it is. It's all happy. recorded. Really? Yeah. You rolling, you got it. It's all recorded. Oh, okay. Yo, 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 you know what time it is, your boy DC on flight. You're not listening to the Steve Harvey Morning Show. Uh-huh, hi, this is, oh, come on, hi. <laughs> <laughs> hi. Hi. Uh, I said hi. This your boy. <laughs> hey, what's going on? This your boy DC on flag. Coming up next is the strawberry letter on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. Come on, nephew, tell me how to pray. Uh oh, you know what time it is? Your boy DC on fly. Coming up next is my ugly nephew. Tell me has a prank for you. You know what's going on? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, it's your boy DC Young Fly. Wake that ass up! You're listening to the baddest radio show on the land, the Steve Harvey Morning Show. Okay, make sure you follow Steve Harvey FM on Fable. Damn it! <laughs> uh oh, you know what's happening? It's your boy DC Young Fly <laughs> again. Make sure you follow Steve Harvey FM on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and follow me. Hey, you talking about follow him? Follow me, <laughs> DC Young Fly. Fuck <laughs> me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we gonna use that one. <laughs> Daddy, follow me too. You ain't talking about it. Oh, okay. Uh-oh, what's up? It's your boy, DC on Fly. But make sure you check out steveharvinfm.com. The nigga got a website. <laughs> he got a radio website? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Who is on the the internet listening to the radio? <laughs> Why, Stop. they can just get in their car. Some people don't have They ain't a got no car. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Yeah. It makes sense. Surely, <laughs> wet napkins over there, and ain't nobody said nothing. Oh, surely is. Uh oh, you know what time it is? Your boy DC on fly, and coming up next is nephew. Go oh, okay, coming up next, the nephew is going to run that prank. Okay, you already know what time it is. Your boy DC on fly. Hey man, the homie nephew is about to run that prank right back. Homie nephew. <laughs> okay. the the ready? That's his name. Shit. All right. You ready? Okay. Oh, my bad. It's recording. Right. Hey, you already know what it is. Your boy Michael Bays didn't lie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just playing as Chico Bean, and you're listening to the Steve Harvey Morning Show. Was that good? I think that I was love good. It. All right, I'm just going to do the rest of them like that. Hey, you already know what it is. It's your boy Chico Bean <laughs> using Michael Bays then's voice. <laughs> Next is the Strawberry Letter on Steve Harvey Morning Show. We're going to talk about does your woman love you when you don't have a shape up? Coming up on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. Hey, you already know what it is, your boy Chico Bean using Michael Bazin's voice. And coming up next, nephew Tommy has a prank for you. I don't know what it's going to be, but it's going to be funny. That's right. Like if your woman leaves and laughs at you on the way out. Steve Harvey Morning Show. Good morning, it's your boy Chico Bean using Michael Bazin's voice. Again, and you're listening to the baddest radio show in the land, the Steve Harvey Morning Show. We talk about things like if your woman doesn't believe you, do you still lie or tell the truth? Coming up next on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. Hi, it's your boy Chico Bean, still using Michael Bazin's voice. Make sure you follow Steve Harvey FM on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, where most men get caught cheating by their woman. Coming up next on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. You thought it was over, but it's still, still Chico Bean using Michael Bazin's voice. Make sure you check out steveharveyfm.com. <laughs>
One more time, hi, it's your boy Chico Bean using Michael Bazin's voice. And coming up next, the nephew. Who's nephew? I don't know. Probably a nephew of a relationship that has ended badly. We're going to talk about it coming up next after he runs that prank back on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. <laughs> now, Chico, now what we're going to do is we're going to sit here and we're going to listen to the Steve Harvey Morning Show. That's, the, that's all we're going to do. We're going to sit here. It's going to be a good morning. We're going to have us some breakfast. We're going to listen to Steve Harvey Morning Show. That's breakfast. all we're going to do. Let's talk about breakfast. If your woman does not cook you breakfast, does that mean that she does not care about you? Coming up live on the Steve Harvey Morning Show, she go being with Michael Bazin's voice. We are live on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. The left without. I know. We got Steve Harvey in the morning. It's a morning. Like Michael Bay. <laughs> uh-huh. Tommy Carla. Hey, Carl. Hello, Carla. Hey, Tommy. We was in Bingham John. I'm just wearing these. One more time. Read it again. I sent it to, um, let me email it to you. Carla, can you email the one real quick? Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. Thank you. No problem. He's coming out. Uh, you should be home by nine. Oh, okay. So we're gonna knock you off. He told me, take your other info. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they got to go picture, bro. You gotta see how stupid the picture is, bro. Let me show you, bro. Check the email, boo. I'm so stupid. I can't even post mm -hmm. this shit. This is how stupid well, it is. I'm gonna post it, though. <laughs> Bad ass bitch. You can't even post it. My little dumb ass. Yeah, <laughs> so Chad and Joe are here, yeah. guys. Uh -oh. Hide the valuables. <laughs> <laughs> Who the hell drew that picture of Steve Crank? Can we get that? Uh, yeah, that's the last song. Uh, Can we get that? Up he did at yeah. MGM in Vegas. Can we get that? He cracked. Yeah, like a big dog. He had that gold mic. He cracked. That's actually a painting of a picture of him. A picture of him. And he cracked. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to get past that part. He cracked. He never he cried. He cried. I'm going to miss y'all so. <laughs> See y'all in the morning on the radio. We're ready. <laughs> we rolled out. Okay. Steve cried at his last show. Oh, you know what can you do? You see it? <laughs> Come over here, bro. He crying like hell on this thing. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, are we recording? He's oh, oh, started yet. He started yet. He started yet. He, 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 he took his towel off and cried. <laughs> he ain't need cry. He was high. He put some vibes in here. He was happy to leave y'all. All right. Bye. They're ready. Oh, ready. You guys ready? Yes. Good afternoon. Good morning. They saying, saying let's rock like they're not at the house on the couch right now. Yeah. Like, hurry up now. Come on now. I'm about to watch this Netflix series now. Y'all got to hear this. Up. You can hear me. I can't, can't hear now. Turn your headphones up, up, baby. Headphones right up. there. Uh -huh. My know. headphones wasn't up as well. Oh, sound like the radio now. <laughs> you can listen to the now? Steve yeah, Harvey see, Morning Radio Show. All right, let's get it. Let's get it because it wasn't recorded. Oh, all this is on tape. It is. All of it. Good. Cause Steve was a crime. <laughs> All right, cat dog. Let's get a drum roll, man. Can we get a drum roll real quick? You want a drum roll? Thank you, sir. These guys right here, all stand-up comedians. They yeah. doing big things separately in comedy, but together, together, they make up 85 South, which is a show that's on tour and selling out all over the country. This gonna be good. We got all three of them back in the studio again. Put your hands together, DC Young Fly. Uh oh. Carlos Miller yeah. and Chico Bean. Yeah, you already know what it is, baby. We live. Oh, <laughs> where you at? 85 South in the building. Yes, yeah. indeed. How y'all been, been, man? What's guys? up, Bully? What's up with you? <laughs> but y'all got more energy than anything. Y'all good? Oh, yeah, yeah man. You know, good. we got to be live when we come up here and kick it with Joe. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. All right, all right. Where so you let's at? talk about it, man. It's going down <laughs> tonight. Man, this yeah, this let, food. Like talking to a ghost. Yeah, where you at? Just, we can't even pretend. He said, where you at? He said, y'all got all the energy. You know he is in the kitchen right now making a turkey sandwich. Y'all got all the energy. <laughs> like, you watching me, but hey. I can't see you. Yeah, you funny. Why, boy, you cr why are you? Yeah, I know. He keep hitting the button. Hey, pass me that mustard. Hey, yeah, you know we got the 85 South boys in the building. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Well, welcome. So nobody had to interview y'all. Just let y'all well, run let with him go. it. Just just... let him go. We ain't playing. We ain't going to let him know you ain't here. All right. <laughs> but can we let him know about the Palladium tonight? <laughs> we ain't oh, yeah. Can we oh, do yeah. that? Hey, nephew. Uh, it's, what going, it do, baby? it's going down at the Palladium, man. We got a few more little VIP meet and greet tickets left, man. 
But okay. we probably we probably just cuffed them. I don't know, bro. It, it, LA showing us much love, man. Hey, it was man, selling I, out. Going we, crazy, two thousand seater, man. We appreciate it, LA, man. Yeah, yeah. None of that what twelve dollar LA comedy they selling out here. We we get <laughs> paid to tell you. Comedy? Yeah, <laughs> they wanted me to fill out a W nine for twelve fifty. I said, <laughs> get my check to the waitress. <laughs> <laughs> for real. It's terrible they make you fill out that uh, form for that little bit of money. You like, I'm not can, leaving what, my social what can security LA and the number in here with y'all. Say what? What'd you say, OG? What could LA expect tonight? <laughs> Man, some East Coast shit. I'm... <laughs> mm. Ladies and gentlemen, right there, that was a slip up, but we are still live on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. Right. This episode is dedicated to things happening that are not supposed to happen, but you got to move on from them. That's right. We live. And what L.A. can expect is a great show full of words that you just heard just I'm now sorry. on the radio by accident. D.C. Young Fly. Oh, Some of that God. stuff right there. Yeah. Some of that. Oh, y'all got to come back every day. It's gonna be Some great. of that stuff. <laughs> Uh, Nephew, we got it. Carla Jr., let me tell y'all something. Mm -hmm. 85 yeah. South came to Houston, Texas. Uh oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. OG did it. Oh, man. Oh, it came I to saw House they of did Blues. It. I uh -huh. saw they did it. Uh -huh. I, I had the privilege of, of of introducing them that night, and let me tell you something. When these three hit the stage, oh, it's fire. Yeah. yeah. It it's is fire, fire from the beginning to yeah. the ending. Mm -hmm. Oh, nonstop, man. You want to so see. Expect. I appreciate it. Stupid OG. on steroids. That's what I'm this is. I'm talking about. Yeah, they stupid on stupid. Good, I like that. Just <laughs> Because you know, you know, I I hear so corporate. Listen here, if you tired of being corporate and uh -huh. you just want to let loose, <laughs> this is the show Come where on. you can let loose, <laughs> let loose. You know how you get in the car, you be like, yeah. <laughs> That's it. This is this is the place, man. What's the noise, DC? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know they boss, they all in their face. I'm gonna need you to. They be wanna. Yeah. Get out my face. That's what we bringing, man. We bringing that, that hilarious. Um, y'all bringing that. Y'all bringing that ignorance. That's what we bring. Oh, LA, I'm telling you, mm -hmm. LA. Hey, listen, tonight. Wear your Sunday best dress. You do not want to miss 85 South. It's at the Palladium tonight in LA. Get your tickets. They on sale tonight. right now. <laughs> 85 South is nothing to miss. I have been there. I am a witness, mm -hmm. and I promise you, as soon as I see them again, I'm in the same city, I'm right there front row. I appreciate on, it, OG. I appreciate it. Thank you, man. Appreciate DC it. Young Fly, uh -oh. Carlos Miller, Chico Bean. Is it more than one break? Ladies and gentlemen, we don't know what's going on right now in the studio, but we still live on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. Uh, 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 Just make sure you're tuned in and you stay tuned in. Next up, we got a little bit of that uh, we got a little bit of that Michael McDonald coming up. We usually don't play him, but it's going down today on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. That's right. Stay tuned, ladies and gentlemen. 85 South Live on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. That's right. Go to 85southshow.com. Come on. For all the information. Yes. Everything. And we have sleepwear for sale on sleepwear? the website. Okay. That is yes. a great voice okay. for weather in the morning. I want to hear you say the weather in the morning with that voice. Right. Ooh, that is Thank a great you. voice We're going to tune weather. in to it Shirley Strawberry with oh! the weather. Carlos, you said you had a letter for me. Man. Uh-oh. <laughs> I just, I, I always listen to the Strawberry Letter. Thank you. Uh -oh. I'm a fan. Your I voice is it. so calming and so soothing. <laughs> I don't care what the problem is. I just love the way you read. <laughs> right. Then I just say, I don't care if it's raining. I say, I want to hear from her. I do. <laughs> Tell me that it's raining. They, didn't, they got Shirley up here with blue hair. What you doing, Shirley? Been She's listening to Meg Thee Stallion. What you is Shirley on? Oh, you didn't know? She was in the church. Uh -huh. Now she's trying to have a hot girl from the church. Still in the church now. Hey, still still in the church. You don't see the nails match the hair the Come same on. exact color. And then still the crib. shoes match the nails. Ooh. Shirley, you can't be uh -oh. wearing all these loud colors. This is L.A. What? You are representing the wrong game. She messed with a young guy. <laughs> right. Only a young guy do that to you. Yeah, put that on, baby. Yeah, put that blue on your nails. No, your put hair. that on, cuz. <laughs> put that blue on your nails. In your hair. <laughs> anyway, go to 85southshow.com for all the information all you need for yes. the 85 South Show. Yes. These crazy people. We ain't playing. Y'all know what time it is. Put Man, up. I am uh oh, food. you put on fact on that? Put up. Junior, uh, you just Duh. introduce them and then you Duh. just let them I'm go. I'm sitting over here so damn shady. <laughs> Junior better not say nothing with these shiny ass nails. I know that. <laughs> Junior over here with these beautiful hey, ass nails. Buff. That ain't buffed. That is, that yeah. is yeah. acrylic. Yeah. He got that acrylic. Boy, Oh, it looked like he got, got a jail hey, set. It looked like he didn't went in there and painted his nails with Krispy Kreme icing. <laughs> Junior was sitting there with all ten under the dryer. <laughs> yeah, I just went in there and got some so Krispy Wait, Kreme see his feet. He a fool with oh. some open toe sandals this summer. With the thong slippers. With the thong slippers. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, my boy got the thong slippers. Got the good Bethlehem ah, on. Oh, we oh got the thong slippers. <sighs> Oh, this is how y'all get down up here in the no, morning. This is how y'all get down. This is how I go down in the morning. But, but it's right now it's stupid on steroids yeah. with you Man. guys. Though. For real. This just, this just the, the beginning. They ain't need. <laughs> you so want to see the red? Um, Pull up. <laughs> okay, y'all. So let's 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 set up a new break. Okay. We got a lot oh, of content okay. right there, so the audience can uh, follow along. Um, on the on the um. On the questions, is, is there some topics y'all want to talk about? Like what's going on? Like the drug bust in Philly. We don't sell politics, drugs. I don't know. I don't watch like TV that. like that. What's going on in the world? No, I don't know nothing <laughs> about that. They but, just had okay. a drug bust in Philly, girl. Who got bust? <laughs> <laughs> they found well, fifteen thousand kilos of cocaine at a port 15, in Philadelphia. Fit one billion dollars yeah. worth. Yeah. One who billion counted? Dollars who counted? Who is on this much cocaine? I said, who is on this much cocaine? Can I get an eight ball? Oh, that's a billion. Ball. The U.S. say, but the crazy thing I is, think I'm in the wrong they caught that billion just so the other six that they really got into the country could get in. That was oh, the decoy right there. Yeah. 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 Let's yeah. talk about that. Talk let's talk about talk. set it up. Okay, y'all, let's set They're it up. Come on, Tommy, well, bringing it back. They weren't yeah, recording. Yeah, but it's not flowing. It wasn't we recorded. <laughs> Yeah, they have a structure. It's radio, baby. We got to yeah. follow the structure. I'm sorry, man. We don't work in radio. We don't know what the hell's going on. We just came to promote the show. Okay, good, here we go, guys. Good. You can it's fast good. forward and glue it together. Said, no, it's good. It's good. You just it's don't good. flow right. It's Shut good. up so we can ask something. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Hell. Let us ask, then you talk. <laughs> Let us ask, then you talk. Shut up. Uh, Let us ask, then you talk. Shut up. Three, two, one. Oh, my God. We are back with when? 85 South still in the building. Yes. That's DC Young Fly. Yes. Carlos we ain't Miller and the one and only Chico <laughs> we ain't B. Gonna yeah, we in here. We yeah. ain't going nowhere. Here. I want it all oh on the air, God. though. Off the air, on the uh, air, everything. Everything. Yes. Everything. Well, everything. Everything. Man, all come on. We ain't never well, we asked y'all. We asked y'all off the air if you heard about the drug bust that took place in Philadelphia. Over $1 billion worth what? of drugs. Y'all just told us about it. What? 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 <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what they catch him with, nephew? Ooh, you playing. <laughs> I think it was cocaine. Uh, what oh. made you think that? Oh. Why would you think that, nephew? Oh, when? 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 When they do that? Well, I don't think it was weed. I think it was cocaine. Really? Oh, oh, oh my God. Go, uh, a billion dollars. What, what, what was yeah. it on a boat? What? what? It was on a boat. Oh, oh Lord, boat. they got boats now. Good. Oh, it wasn't God. on a truck. Woo. Oh, my God. A billion dollars worth of cocaine. I <laughs> wish I had a billion noses. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> a billion noses. Would you be able to? I mean, would that be Would that be a, 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 a cocaine per nose? Uh, I don't know. I've never done cocaine. I don't uh, like the way it smells. Who is on this much cocaine? That is a billion dollar worth of cocaine. Who is still on this much cocaine? But this is what they don't tell you. They found two billion dollars worth of baking soda in another truck. <laughs> Somebody's about to cook all of Listen, that. Hey, Somebody's hey, finna Carlos, get that. Carlos, we done talked about this. Baking soda ruined the black community. I don't yes, think it, it get Baking soda ruined the black community. Yes, cocaine did. had been around for thousands of years. Right. But once they mm -hmm. hit it with that baking soda and made that rock, it was over yeah. with. Like baking a soda. Rock. Bacon, you can just go. Oh, like a rock. That's how they were singing for him in the 80s. Hey, this is a very serious topic, and I want to take the time right now to say shout out to everybody who's been clean for over three days. <laughs> Cause we know that it's hard. That little first, that first forty-eight hours. Come on, man. They been off since Monday. Come on. <laughs> hey, boy, I'm talking about you in sweat. Yeah. <laughs> he said up. three days. They just been off since Monday. It ain't that you quit. You just can't find none. Shout out to y'all. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> you in a drought. Uh, Caught up in a drought. <laughs> Smoking a lot of weed. I'm talking about a lot of it. Just on them oh cigarettes till you can find a new man. plug. Uh -huh. Boy, you is stupid. Uh, DC, man, you, smoke you, a lot of weed, but you can tell they ain't got that. But let me get out. DC, take a rest. DC, DC, DC. <laughs> Look, he talking to us something. like a, like he the guidance counselor. DC, I told y'all stop sending these boys to my office at the same time. Hey, he said with a crackhead, they got a crack. They smoke a lot of weed. <laughs> This dude is that's crazy. the way. That's the way Gail was calling Robert. 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 Yes, yes uh, I meant nephew. Yes. <laughs> All right, DC. Oh, you done nephew. a few movies. You done put some music together. Uh, what projects are you working on right now? That's my uncle nephew. Uncle, ne <laughs> 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 uncle nephew. Oh, I am crying. Oh, I'm really still on people uh, getting uh, off three days ago. Uh, okay. What's up, uh, uncle nephew? Uh, 
Uncle Nell. Okay. Uncle Nell. Okay. Okay. Uncle Nell. What? What you say? Let him go. I say, what are you currently working on? I'm working on Steve Harvey Morning Show. Now we're working on the script for Uncle Nephew starting right now. The script for Uncle Nephew just started getting created right now. It's I'm a, it's at work, Uncle it's Nephew. A, Uncle Nephew, starring Uncle Nephew right there. You just got to let us be the nephews. Oh, man. Oh, my, yes. okay, okay, okay. Y'all the nephews, I'm the uncle. Okay. Okay. Uncle Nephew. But you I Uncle Nephew. It. But no, uh, uh, okay, I got the hookup, too. It's coming out with Fatboy SAC's Master P, uh, July 12th, and theaters everywhere. Uh, moving with Jay Farrah and Cat Williams and uh, Dion Cole, Two Minutes of Fame. Uh, it's gonna drop like in September with Lionsgate. Uh, me and I'm Lee. in there too. I yep. forgot. You in there too? I'm in there too. My boy. I'm playing the handsome comedian. They Come just on, let Carlos. me be myself. <laughs> <laughs> nah, for real, for real, for real. Um, and we was in uh How How Too. Come on. Oh, uh, look, Yada. Yes, uh, yeah. that went crazy. You see how that works? So. Everything he on, I'm getting in there. You I'm doing did. something. You're doing something. <laughs> and while and out, the other show you're on just won. While and out, uh -huh. we did just win an MTV, MTV Award. Uh, mm -hmm. shout out to Nick Cannon. Uh, we got like 60 more episodes of that. VH1 Hip Hop Squares, I'm yep. on that, so. Oh, yeah. And the podcast! Come on. <laughs> we going crazy, Uncle Nephew! Man, <laughs> all right. Okay, okay so, so we... Nephew Carlos. What's happening? All right, then. You already know about, I know about you. You've been in the comedy game. You're strong with it. What projects you working on? Uh, Other than the ones that DC already on. Like, that ain't a lot. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of projects. Okay, uh, no. Nah. <laughs> he said, uh, well... I'm actually working oh, on a Thank new you. set of GED books. I got my own <laughs> GED books coming out for people who want to learn how to read and do math. Uh, I have a I have a t-shirt sleepwear line that I'm about to launch for all the ladies who don't like wearing lingerie. It's just a bunch of soft t-shirts and old sweatpants, pre-shrunk, pre-worn. Uh, Few TV pro, you know I haven't really convinced Hollywood to like me like that, but I'm, I'm on a few underground uh, rap videos and stuff like that. You know, I, I make my money in the daytime. You know, I tell jokes at night. I'm not as successful as DC and the rest of the gang, but I'm because I'm older than them. I should have started earlier. But uh, <laughs> they be like, he too old, his voice too rash, man. Oh, man. He don't just be following directions like that. I be asking questions, so Hollywood ain't really just. Calling me like that when they need, you know, somebody with some leverage, they're gonna hit me. Uh, <laughs> when they need a, a honorary older man, they'll hit me. Uh, but I, don't don't never think that I'm hungry over here, nephew. Don't never think that I'm I'm hungry. Sleep well, like. Those GED books are doing really well, and they're gonna be in all the driver license place. You can just pick them up. I got a lot of things coming. I got some lace front glue that uh, yes. keep the lace front on. Uh, uh -huh. and, and some of those stones that get the calluses off your feet. Bro, I'm trying to expand <laughs> beyond comedy. It's the not calluses. just about the stone that the, 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 the pumice stone. Off the your stone. Yeah. Right. <laughs> I'm an entrepreneur. I, I sell Okay, things. so let me, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. What about uh, black men don't cheat? Tell uh, me about that. Wow, nephew, you you knew that was me? Because somebody just done <laughs> took that and ran with it. Uh -oh. Somebody just done made that their own. But that's neither here nor there. It's not about me, nephew. I did okay. this for us. You, I said black Come men. Come on, now. That Come means on. more than one. Come on, man. Because if I would have right. said a black man, I would have been talking about myself. Uh -oh. So this is not mm -hmm. a selfish movement. I want to yeah. see people take parts of that and add parts to that because that's what it's for. It's the table that all black men can sit down at and be like, you know what? This is what we on. Talk your we changing talk. the perception of us. Talk your so, if, so, so, if an, so if another black man wants to jump out and make a tune, that's not going to mm -hmm. be the only one. We're going to have a whole bunch of these. Talk your t shirts yeah. merchandise, sleepwear, pumice stones, <laughs> coffee mugs. <laughs> <laughs> pumice stones. Black men don't cheat. Black men don't cheat. Black men don't cheat. Black Black don't cheat. cheat. Now, the thing that my whole <laughs> message is, bro, we're just trying to change the perception of black men. We're just yeah. trying to bring some positivity to the table. Mm -hmm. So shout out to, to uh, Duval and Charlemagne for bringing that. Night. That's a dope song, bro. I really like it. So, you know, it ain't even no hard feelings or nothing like that. I'm supporting the movement 100%. Mm -hmm. So... Yeah. yeah, that's that. Now, when do we release the shirts for Black Men Don't Cheat? Uh, man, I got them on me. <laughs> I got them on me. How many? Uh, I got them on. I keep them on me, my dog. Hit my website. Get one from me, since you know that's me. Buy one from me, but you can still support the other people. Just get one from me. Yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah. Okay.
right, all right. Yeah. Nephew, nephew Chico. It. Hey, listen, I'm just going to let you know right now, I'm working on my radio voice because you ain't asked me nothing yet. And we got 30 <laughs> seconds left. So I'm coming for your job right here. Nephew Tommy is no longer employed by Steve Harvey Morning Show. It is now Chico Bean, Uncle Nephew Jr. That's right. We coming. It's going down because I got to have some work too, baby. So, yeah, appreciate you, Uncle Nephew. Uh for all no, of your you service, but we are no longer needed over here at the Steve Harvey Morning Show because Uncle Nephew Jr. is taking over. What you working on? Uh, this. Oh, <laughs> yeah. This, this right here. Just trying to figure this out, this yeah. little thing. You right got to focus. When you work here, you got to focus. Steve don't want you having no outside yeah. hustle. You got to just do this primarily. Got to so. go volume plus, volume low, right. TB. I don't know what that is. TB yeah. to That's BRD, tuberculosis. OP. Yeah. And then, and then, then cough. Tuberculosis. <laughs> Did oh, you say tuberculosis? He's got a cough button on the on the. What the cough button? Y'all get for? Palladium tonight. Hold the oh, button. Yeah. Cough. Yes, LA. Palladium tonight. Right. Uh oh, Shirley, you coming? I'm gonna come. Yeah, that's really? not enough. Are you inviting me? Come on, me, Shirley. That I come on. I, I know. Shirley. To Shirley. I want you to be my Shirley. Siri voice now. I don't even want Siri <laughs> voice on my phone no more. I want yours, Miss Shirley. You. I, I want you, you to order all my food. You got the voice. They is not gonna fuck up. I'm gonna die. Hey, you yeah. And ladies and gentlemen, you again, you one, hear it, DC. you hear it, ladies and gentlemen, ah. right here on the Steve Harvey Morning Show, <laughs> Uncle Nephew Jr. Okay. Just love Shirley Can y'all sing us out 85 South Style? Can you do that? The Steve Harvey Morning Show. You sound like the deacon that That's we don't want to sing. We like, yeah. man, he gonna fall asleep. The Stop. Steve, sing it out. <laughs> I said. <laughs> Come on now. Come on now. Bring it. Kick it off. <laughs> Kick it off. Come on, bring it. I said, <laughs> Steve Ballhead, but got a stiff mustache. Oh, one more time. Come on, sing it. I said, Steve Ballhead, yeah. but got a mustache. The mustache. Hey, it looked look kind of like the potato head mustache. <laughs> 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 what? They not gonna play that. I'm, I'm, I'm saying it, dude. But I I'm like it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Take it back off, DC. <laughs> <laughs> you should have just left it at the old gospel oh, boy. Yeah. Singing us out. Yeah. Oh, we got the bit the potato. <laughs> Uh, that's what it look like. Y'all, we're never going to be able to come back. I know. We no, are. Now y'all going to come back. Always. Always. Oh, always come back. And you know, oh, Steve, oh, Steve ain't heard this. Don't play it. Oh, like, which bro, one of them said that? We got to put the potato head. Right. Well, well, let's I, do a let take two. Let's do a take two. Oh, that's beautiful. Can I give a shout out to Steve? <laughs> Steve yeah. said some of the coldest literature I've ever heard. What'd he say? When he mm. said, the best thing you can do for poor people is don't be one of them. Uh -huh. Changed uh -huh. my life. I went and opened a savings account. Yeah. <laughs> that, was good. that was advice from his dad, <laughs> too, Carlos. Yeah. Would have got an account at Walmart. Yeah, I got a Walmart card now. Uh, got one. Uh, he don't be playing. Uh, All right. Man. 85 South tonight at the Palladium Live in the L.A. You do show. not want to miss them. That man. is... DC Young Fly, Carlos <laughs> Miller, and Chico <laughs> Bean. Yes, we're oh, here. Yeah. Oh, uh, Uncle Nephew. 85 South yes, Show. Yes, indeed. That's the podcast. Uncle Are we Nephew. At the end? You need your own thing when you Are come on. Are we at on. the end? Uncle Nephew, live on the radio waves. Gotta be a honk. <laughs> meet me. <laughs> right after that. <laughs> Uncle Nephew, he married live to the family. on the radio waves. Meet me. Right there. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> We got That's the traffic it. report coming up in two <laughs> minutes. Stay tuned on the Steve Harvey Morning Radio Experience with Shirley Strawberry and Mississippi Monica. And Uncle Nephew, live on the radio waves. Meet me. <laughs> <laughs> My boy in the Volvo, man. That boy. <laughs> Uh, uh, hey, them Volvos run up to about 400,000 miles. Yeah, man. easy. Boy, you crazy. Never had hey. to put an alternator on. Oh, you no, ain't no, never seen no, no Volvo at no car shop. No. All right. Uh, All right. We, we Carla? <laughs> Carla? Oh, man. Yes. Carla Have we quit. been out? Yeah, she Carla. quit. She ain't, she didn't been quit. Me, me, me. Thank you, guys. Edit, edit all that, Kay. Cut all of that me, out. Me, me, me. All the cussing. Oh, oh man. I ain't oh, no. even say no curse word. Mm -mm. Well, I bleep mine out. My bad. <laughs> <laughs>